Okay, okay, we're gonna use this tool here. Um, this has got a patent pending on it, and it's called a brake drum puller in uh, colloquial terms, but in scientific terms, it's called a brake drum remover and uh, remounter. So Honda, Toyota, and Nissan have very conveniently put some screw holes in their drums. And these are for a very specific person, purpose. If in fact the drum does not want to come off, which it may not want to. So we start these, get a little bit difficult. They don't want to come off. Now, the reason why it's difficult because we need to turn the, the brake off. Okay, we, you can see that we have the brake off. And uh, this drum now wants to come off. Uh, it's good to have something underneath here. Uh, see, we can use this as a puller because it can get very hot and if the car comes right in, it can be very difficult. If you're a mechanic, it can be very difficult for you to work with this without some rags and a bunch of different things. But with this tool, you don't have a problem. And then you can set it right down and you can see inside there, there's brake dust. And uh, it used to be that was asbestos and you didn't want to breathe that and mechanics would often <laughs> just take that and put it around. I can tell it's tighter this time. It's getting more difficult though. Yeah. But the other technique um, is to use these screws to hit up against the hub and force the two surfaces apart. I don't ever have any problems getting a, a drum off. If I have a drum that gets stuck on there, just take the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, right off. Mm -hmm. But personally, as in for this thing, mm -hmm. I, wouldn't choose, I wouldn't change it in any way, shape, form, or fashion. It works great the way it is. Uh, I just just take off my own drums. On my okay. Own when I pulled the wheel off, it, mm -hmm. the hub was a little rusty. The wheel mm -hmm. didn't come off, so I took some emery cloth and sanded the hub down a little bit, got the rust knocked off, and mm -hmm. even still tapping it with a hammer, it still didn't come off. So I snugged up the tool on there and mm -hmm. wiggled it a little bit, popped right off. Popped right off. Uh, well, me, Technician Ralph, um, mm -hmm. I love the tool. Mm -hmm. It actually makes the job way easier. Okay. Um, the easiest part was actually pretty much getting it back on. But the tool makes it way easier to get the job in and out. And so you're you're speeding up the job by what, 20-30%? Yes, no, 20-30%, 40 actually. I would 40%? Say. 40%, yeah. yes, makes I've, those rear brakes so much easier. Yeah. I would say I would pay over 100, I would. Really? It's definitely worth it. 